Hey guys, it's John. This is Rad 2, episode 21, I think. I forget. I'm pretty sure it's 21. <laughs> I did good and remembered last time, but I didn't remember this time. Let me look at it. Okay, it is 21. Cool. Um, okay, so if you don't know, uh, what's today? Today's the 28th of January. They just, or Dreams, just updated Rad 2. So, uh, if you haven't updated Rad 2, go update it. I never say that. I always forget to tell you guys to update, but now I'm doing it. So, they just released an update two days ago. So, go update your Rad 2. Um, hopefully there's no crazy bugs. I saw he released, like, an alpha patch for this one. It's 0.96a, I think, or something. Um, I got a lot of crap to do this time. I've been getting tons of advice from all of you guys, all my commenters and viewers. And we got a lot of crap to do. Um, first things first... Dreams has nerfed a lot of stuff. He's like added uh, skill requirements and stuff for like the gathering tools. I guess it's no longer excavation. Now it's a gathering skill. So uh, I shamelessly used uh, creative mode to give me level 40 gathering or not creative mode, but uh, the project MMO uh, XP commands or level commands because I am not doing that shit again. And I've already put in the work of getting these to level 40. So I'm like, fuck that. Uh, people were saying it's annoying to level gathering too, so I'm not sure what they mean by that. I don't know how it's different now. I don't know if you just get gathering XP just from, you know, chopping wood and and digging. I'm not sure how that works. Um, also, he nerfed the scythe. I don't know if it still does the same damage. I'm assuming it does the same damage, but um, you need level 65 in order to use the netherite scythe. So I had to actually disenchant my netherite scythe and make a new one, uh, a new diamond one. And look at now the combat level is 45. It used to be like 21 or something like that. So he has uh, nerfed it. Um, Anything else I can think of that's changed? Uh, Oh yeah, look at this old our explosive bow is totally garbo now. Or I can't even use it. I need 65 archery. But I can still use this one. So see, he hasn't even nerfed this shit yet. So he missed the Spartan weaponry stuff. Because this one's only archery level 10. Um, So in case you didn't read the comments last time... Probably the most important thing we learned was from, where is your name? I think it's Nikolai, Nikolai Schler, or it could be Nikolais. I don't know. I Nikolai, if I'm saying your name wrong, please tell me. I think it's Nikolai. He figured out, or maybe he read in the Rad Discord, who knows, that you can make like this ritual of scrying with the uh, Ars Novo mod. And basically you could go to the nether and use this ritual of scrying to basically search for ancient debris. And it gives you like x-ray vision. I'm going to do that this episode. I'm not going to do it right now. I will do it in a bit. I need to actually build a bunch of crap for the rituals and all that. And I need to get a bunch of uh, the magic juice, the source jars and all that to do it. But in case you don't know, um, yeah, you can go look at the previous episode. I think it's episode 20. I pinned the comment. He tells you exactly how to do it and basically get a ton of netherite pretty easily. I, I don't think it's too bad, um, but I haven't tried it yet. Maybe it is kind of bad. I'm not sure. It seems like it's uh, almost too good to be true. Um, another thing I learned, I'm going to get an everlasting steak. Who said this? I'm actually writing people's names down so now I can tell you guys. Uh, oh yeah, it was Dooley. Dooley said you can buy an eternal steak, which is obviously a steak that you can just keep eating and you can get it from the, God, I got to fix all these stupid teleports now. They're all jacked up. Uh, you can get it from the coin shop for a diamond coin. So we're going to go do that right now. You can buy diamond coins with a nether star. So you guessed it. We're going to go kill us a wither. Real quick like. I want my XP to go down before I do this. We got to go kill our daily uh, ender dragon too. People were saying you could get... Uh, Dragon Slayer XP from killing the Ender Dragon, but I don't think I was getting Dragon Slayer XP from that. I'm not sure. Something looks different. I mean, I'm so used to coming here at night. Uh, shit. Maybe I shouldn't fight the Wither here. He's gonna fuck up my my arena. I should probably move him over here. Yeah, I guess we'll fight him over here. He's gonna die super quick. Uh, oh. <laughs> uh okay. Let's see. This is the second time I'm fighting a wither, so who knows? He might be... He might be a pain. He might beat my ass. We'll see. It's 
It's always white. Oh, uh, must be because of the shaders. Holy shit, he's already dead. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> My computer kind of like lagged out a little bit. He just died. Holy crap. Uh, okay. Cool. Guess I'm still doing crazy damage with the diamond thingy. Or the diamond scythe. Alright, there's the nether star. Uh, maybe I just haven't fought him in so long. That I just do so much damage. What'd you give me? Uh, did he give me another nether star? Oh no. Well, that's cool. He gave me some netherite. That's nice. Okay, let's see. Right here, we got our nether star. And we need 10 levels. Well, I can get you 10 levels. Easy. There's our diamond coin. Turn off our XP. So yeah, right here, you can turn in a diamond coin. And you get this choice repeatable award. Look at, oh, it's got a bunch of good shit in here. This is like all the stuff I've been wanting. Oh my god. This is like some dirty shit right here. Oh, that one has durability. You can unlock it. Stellar Catalyst. Summon a Falling Star. Huh, that sounds cool. Yeah, I've seen this Squire's bag before. What does it even do? Durability? Minus 20% movement speed. Slot modifiers. Huh. No idea. Now I'm gonna look at all this. 30% chance of spraying venomous spores. That sounds cool. That's the one that lets you climb, isn't it? it allows you to move through cobwebs. Clamber up walls. Okay, I really don't want to look at all this shit. Suppresses fall damage. But there could be some really OP stuff in here. That's why I'm like, uh, you should probably look. Bounces off targets. That's cool. I have the Scarab. Absorbs incoming damage. Reflects 50% of it. Oh. Huh. Rare scrap. Outrunner? Ooh. That might be good, but... It has durability, though. Midnight robe. Teleports the latest respawn point. Hey, lucky horseshoe. 25% chance to increase the looting. Where's luck? I like all these, uh, these thingies, but I don't like how they have durability. I, I guess that's the use for all of the, uh, mending that I'm getting, right? Jellyfish. Wow, regen underwater, magic resistance. Huh. Oh. Pet damage. Projectiles. Oh, wow, that's cool. Minus 50% attack speed. I have this flower. Ender hand. Drowned belt. 100% dealt underwater damage. Whoa. That's crazy. Postponing any healing or damage taken by 10 seconds. Yeah, I have that. I have that. I wonder what that does. Bloody feather. Bastion ring. Yeah, I have that. Water candle. Oh my god, you could buy the vitamins? What? I'm gonna straight up do that. Hell yeah. Oh, you could buy even the shulker heart, too. Dude, that's OP. You can buy this shit? That's like, dude, I'm gonna farm <laughs> I'm gonna farm the wither right now. I will straight up buy this stuff. What do we need? The shulker heart and then the ring of overclocking. Combine together those two. The vitamins. We just need that forbidden... You can buy, oh, dude, oh my god, you can buy all this stuff? Dude, that's some dirty ass shit. I'll straight up do that right now. <laughs> it's allowed by the game. So, hey, increases damage dealt. Oh, that's nice. On your hands? Do I have anything for my hands? Oh, I have that one that you, when you swap items or whatever. Obsidian skull, yeah. Night vision goggles, that's cool. Extra level of fortune. Especially to those you have not recently killed. That's cool. Man, that's actually really nice. More XP? Or more damage? Plus four attack damage. 
More damage is good, but man, I'm kind of like, kind of want that hook, dude. That hook's really nice. Yep, fire damage. There it is, baby. Wow, you could just buy the, like, why did they even do this? You could just buy one of them. Eternal stake. Crystal heart. Ooh. Cloud in the bottle. Yes, the classic. Charm of sinking. Aqua dashers. Dude, this is some dirty shit, dude. Oh my god. I can't believe none of you guys told me about this. What the hell? <laughs> that you could farm the wither. Apparently, none of you guys knew this either, because I didn't. Yeah, right here. This choice repeatable award. You can buy all of those, those like hella OP trinkets. I'm just like, what? Uh, let's go somewhere else, because I don't want to wreck this place. I want to fight the wither. We're going to farm the wither. I want to, we're just going to straight up get the onk shield just like right now. I'm just like, why even? <laughs> like, there's no point of waiting. Might as well just get it. Uh, let's just go somewhere over here. I don't really care about... Yeah, this looks good. Okay, we'll just stay here. We'll just fight the wither here. Where's my sleeping bag? I think I have enough wither skulls. I might have to go farm some. Because we need what? Forbidden fruit, shulker heart, that ring. I just realized that's like a witch's house right there. Uh, vitamins. Bazoar. I think that's it, right? So that's five. So we got to kill five withers. How many skulls did I have? I think I had like 18, didn't I? Oh, so I might have enough. Oof. We'll see. Maybe I miscounted. Maybe there was something else I needed to. Okay, so that changes my plans a little bit. I was planning to do the ritual stuff after I killed the wither. What? What? What happened? Is there like a cooldown? Did I do it wrong? Why is it taking so long to mine those? Oh, it's probably the wrong biome. This is meadow grass. Oops. Dude, what is this thing? Hold up. Whoa. Hold on, I'll come back to you guys. That looks crazy. How's this? Oh, it is on the map. I was like, how's this not on the map? It's crazy. All right, hold on. Let me... Is this dirt? Meadow grass block. So just because this is like a different biome, I think it's not working. It doesn't have to be like on dirt or something. I don't remember. Is this Minecraft? Yeah, grass block. This should work. I don't care if this place gets wrecked. Bam. I forgot he blows up. Holy shit. <laughs> Damn. Straight out one shot your ass. All right. Uh, give me another nether star. Nope. All right. Well, he gave me another skull. That's nice of him. I feel bad almost one-shotting him. I'm like, man, you poor guy. They said he gets stronger, though, like the more times you fight him, so. I wonder if this tree is going to interfere with the spawning. Yep, that's what I thought. There needs to be air, isn't it? Does it need... Does it need sight of the sky? Or it needs more space? I don't remember. Look at, there you go. Gathering and woodcutting skill I got. Interesting. Can you like spawn or what? Oh, this stupid little thing. I didn't even see it. There we go. I almost feel bad fighting this guy. 
But supposedly you're gonna get stronger every time I kill you, so... I shouldn't feel too bad about you. Hey. Look at that. Poor guy. I didn't realize all this water. Looks cool. Alright, let's see if we could buy... Oh crap, I forgot I need levels too. Oh shit, I have a bunch of levels from killing the wither. Oops. Let's see... We want our XP to go down a bit, because I don't want to be spending 10 levels when we're at 30. That's going to take a ton of XP. Alright, that's good enough. All right, what are we buying? What are you buying? Uh, let's... Uh, I don't have a... Anvil. We can combine the Bazaar. And then... What is this? Mimic spawn egg? Anything else we can combine? I don't think so, huh? We just need forbidden fruit. Uh... Shulker heart, vitamins... And then the ring. Where the hell's the ring? Oh, ring of overclocking. Uh, yeah, I guess... Let's buy the forbidden fruit, whatever. So we need three more, right? The Zoar, forbidden fruit. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. Hold on. Okay, I didn't sneeze. It went away. Now it's coming back. Whatever. If I sneeze, I sneeze. Uh, okay. So we need the ring of overclocking, the shulker heart, and then the vitamins. Right? That's it. And then we're done. Dude, this feels so dirty. Like, I feel kind of gross. Doing this. Oh, yeah. And then the sunglasses. Goes into the charm slot. Where else can I put the shield? Charm, back, and body. Well, I can't put it on my back. Oh, okay. Emblem, metal. I totally forgot about those. Can you guys move? So three more to go, huh? Oh, I should have opened this up. Maybe there would have been another star in there. I wonder if you can get another star like that. I did. Dude, did like 300 to him or something. Oh, I forgot about these little nether star shards. Is there any other loot? No. No nether star? What the hell is that? Wither sword? Huh. Looks cool. So we got one, so we just need two more, right? One, two, three. I believe so. This guy's enchanted. He's an elite. Actually got a lot of health, mister. Hey, why are you flying like that, bro? Wow, you should be dead.
Wither Star. Nope, no Wither Star. All right, there you go. Last one. Right. Familiar. Zombie. Look at all the XP though. That's nice. All right, last one. Let's go over here. I guess. Why is my screen all zoomed in? I feel like one of those buffs that I'm getting. Do it right here. <laughs> I'm getting a lot of XP at least. Maybe we won't fight the Wither. Oh no, I actually do want to fight the Wither Dragon or Ender Dragon because I want to. Uh, I want to see if we get Dragon Slayer XP because, like I said, that's what people are saying in the. Discord, but I have a feeling that the Ender Dragon doesn't give you XP like that. I don't know. I could be wrong, but pretty sure I don't remember getting XP from the Ender Dragon. Bunch of Wither. Oh, I got four. What the hell? I must have gotten an extra one. Huh. Oh my god, look at all that XP. Okay, so I think we're done. Let's go back home. There's no reason to be out in the dark. In the scary dark. How much XP do we have now? Oh my god. Damn, we got a lot from that. <laughs> that was nice. Uh, okay. Well, what can we take off? Let's just take everything off because we're gonna combine shit right now anyways. So... Oh yeah, glasses. Oh, dang it. I gotta wait for my XP to go down. I don't want to use that much XP. It's gonna take a while. Oops. Don't do that. I wish it drained XP faster. That would be nice. Uh, well, I guess while this is going, we could talk about other things we're gonna do. Um, I want to do the Wilden Heart Ritual so we can kill the Wilden and make the level 3 spell book. Mm, I really want to try out that gliding rune, the gliding spell, you know, so it's like the Elytra. I want to see if we can make like a really OP, like, jumping slash gliding spell, but I don't know if it's going to work too well, so we'll have to see. Um, I have a feeling we're not going to be able to do as much things as I want to do this episode. I have a feeling we're going to get stuck doing like the rituals and all that, so I don't know. We'll see what happens. Oh yeah, I want to do try and do the Apexes too. David was telling me about uh, the affixes. I didn't even know the Apotheosis boss gear, the ones that are like blue and all that shit. That they uh, they actually actually they have like a lot of really OP buffs on them that you can get. So I want to try and do that too. Let's see. So I have that, my old OP iron sword. Okay, I think that should be good. Right? We got four? Yeah, that's good. I have my old OP iron sword that has like 92% crit or something like that. It's some ridiculous amount of crit and I want to steal it. Okay, let's see. I like these feral claws. Increases the wearer's attack speed. I wonder if you can combine these together. In Terraria, you're able to combine together like... It's like fire gauntlets and then these punching gauntlets or something. So I'm curious if they're going to let you combine those. Uh, oh, I guess it doesn't really matter though because I'm probably going to get this golden hook. For more XP. I should probably just get the damage one. It's like, are you really, do you really need more XP? You already have like 150 levels or something like that. I don't think I really need it. Okay, have the forbidden fruit. Have the bazaar. We need ring of overclocking. There's the Shulker Heart. Oh yeah, we need vitamins. And Mr. Shulker Heart. I wonder if you can actually get the Shulker Heart like from Shulkers, like as a rare drop or something. Curious. Uh, I think that's it, right? That's all the stuff we needed to combine. Now we just need to actually do this.
Didn't I need gold or something? Uh, oh yeah, I'll try. Oh yeah, gold blocks. Okay. I seriously did not expect that we were going to get all this stuff this quickly. Like, I was expecting, oh, we're going to have to farm tons of dungeons and all that shit. And, uh, yeah, I thought it was going to take a long time to get this Ankh charm. But, uh, now that we're here, I'm just like, whoa. Uh, that was a lot faster than I thought. How is this thing supposed to work again? Ankh charm. There we go. Look at that. Oh my god, we already have it. That's crazy, dude. <laughs> I'm, like, really baffled by this. I think he needs to up that to probably, well, they said netherite coin that you just fight. He said in the patch notes to get netherite coins, you fight elite guys in the nether. Look at that. Loot crate, netherite ingot. But who knows what the drop rate is for netherite. Let's look at this is diamond. Oh wait, nether coin. What the hell is the difference between nether coin and... What? Well, maybe this is only for like super bosses or something? Huh. Obsidian. I'm curious to see that. I really want to try that out. Nether coin. Yeah, he said from elites, I guess, in the nether. What's the difference between nether coin and netherite? Well, I don't really know. It doesn't look like you can buy it either. Hmm. Anyways. How much XP? 39. That's a lot, but hey. This is uh, the most broken ass... <laughs> this is like the most broken ass item in the game. Makes you immune to like almost everything. So I guess it's a small price to pay, right? Wild. Increased attack speed. Look at that baby. Most negative status effects when held or equipped. Boom, we got it. Ooh, this is dirty. Very, very dirty getting this pupper so fast so we're now we're immune to like everything basically right immunity to hunger status effect and nausea thank god nausea i think is like the worst debuff in minecraft because it actually makes you nauseous in real life how it spins your screen around immunity to blindness immunity to poison and withering immunity to slowness and levitation and allows free movement i'm curious Immunity to slowness. I wonder if we can still get grab. Remember those yellow endermen that like vomit at you or whatever? I wonder if that will still work with this. I'm pretty sure they'll still be able to slow, like stop you. You like you can't even look. You can't even move around at all. It like paralyzes you. Immunity to weakness and mining fatigue. That's so good, dude. It's so good. Oh my god. It's so dirty. It's some dirty shit. Poison withering. Allows free movement through cobwebs. That's really nice. Weakness and mining fatigue. Oh, mining fatigue. Nice. You wouldn't even need to worry about taking milk. When you go do one of the uh, underwater temples. And partial fire resist and immunity to knockback. Oh my god. Guys, if you are able to kill the wither, please go kill the wither and go get yourself an onk shield. It's like not even hard. Um, in case you've never seen my other videos, you didn't see the one where I was talking about the gear. All you need to do to farm the wither is make a diamond scythe. Well, if you don't have that high, you can make, uh, if you don't have that much combat skill, you can get, I think these crappier ones, right? Yeah, see, look at, you can make an iron one, at least at level 25. Um, make one of these scythes, these are the ones from Spartan Weaponry, and you should be able to farm wither skeletons. You just need to find a wither spawner. I found one in one of the, uh... What is it? The roguelike dungeons? You find these dungeons like everywhere. It's like a tower like this. There's a bunch of them. It's, there's, sometimes it'll be like made out of bricks. See like this. You'll see them around the overworld. You usually will find at least a couple wither skeleton spawners in one of those dungeons. Like on the lower floors. So yeah, make one of these sites because these sites have a high chance of getting wither skulls. Go find one of those wither spawners and just murder a bunch of wither skeletons and you should be able to farm wither skulls pretty easily. And then you just go fight the wither, and that's it. Uh, let's put all this crap away. Okay, so we put everything away. Let's see. Is there something else we want to buy? Uh, 
I kind of don't want to do this because it looks like this stuff's crappy. I think I'd rather try and get an artifact. And there's these relics, but these are the ones that actually you have to put on mending that they would break. Hold on, let's look up that glove. I want to look up the power glove. I want to see if it's like Terraria. Ah, it's not like Terraria. Dang, that sucks. Artifacts. Let's check that in. Artifacts. What? Oh. oh yeah, that's right. I forgot. You gotta put... At sign? There you go. Okay, so I guess you can't combine these? Increases XP. Oh man, that's so nice. I really want that. Where's Mirrors? You can absorb health. Man, that would be nice. I'm kind of tempted to get that. Deal fire damage. Increase attack speed. Maybe that would be good. Mm. No, well, I don't know. Attack speed's nice, but I kind of feel like damage is more important. I'm gonna get the power gloves. Crystal heart. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. I should probably get that. How much, though, I wonder? And it goes on the belt slot? I don't think I have a belt. Antidote vessel. Allows the wire to double jump. Might be good. Move freely in water. That one... Uh, I mean, we have the jump spell. I feel like we kind of don't need that. Strike attackers with lightning. Turns the wear invisible. Extra level of looting. Ah, oh, that would be nice. Let's put that on. I don't think I have a hat, do I? Trading prices. <laughs> Snorkel. Eternal Stake, Shield, and a Glider. The Wearer's Flatulence, yeah, it's from Terraria. What do I want for the glove? I feel like I don't really need Lifesteal because... I don't know, I feel like I, feel like I don't really need Lifesteal because all the times I get really jacked up by a Legendary or something, it's like, dude, Lifesteal's not going to save my ass. He literally hits me for like... 90% of my life, even if I hit somebody else and get some of my life back, he's probably still going to kill me on the second hit. Like, I'm not going to get up to full health in the span of time before a legendary or an ultimate monster, you know, re-engages with me. It's like, dude, you're not going to get back to full health, like, in the span of a second. Like, no way. Unless it's that much life steal. I don't know. Maybe I'm full of shit. See, now I'm questioning myself. I'm like, hmm... I feel like this would be more utility to get the golden hook. Get more XP. Let's see. Do I have anything on these slots? Look at that. Nothing on the head. Where's the belt slot? Hands. Ooh, that's dirty. You can have two hand slots. Hmm. There's the belt. That's really OP. <laughs> I... I don't want to get them both. Although this increases my attack speed. So at the same time, I'm like, hmm, maybe I shouldn't get it. I guess I'll leave it on the list in case I want to get it. Let's, so we're going to need to go kill the wither some more. I know you guys probably are like, oh, great. He's going to go kill the wither some more. But, uh, I want those things. And I think we only need, yeah, three, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, sorry guys. I want. Who's taking everything? I want that stuff. So we might as well get it out of the way now. Where were we again? Oh, right here. Okay. We might as well get it out of the way right now. And then we'll have to do this again. And then the next thing we're probably going to do after this, we'll probably go work on the ritual because I really want to upgrade the netherite stuff. Did I mark this? Oh yeah, I had been there. I forgot. There was like some super buff ombres over here. I think I looted it though. Yeah, it looks like I looted this place. Oh, 
Uh, I guess we'll just put it here. Again. And I one shot him? Nope. Doesn't count, he's an elite. Wow. Wow. Oh, I forgot about the the little shards. I had like what six or seven of them, I think. Hold on, let's check. They wither shards or what were they? Nether shards. Six of them. Ooh, because you can make another. Oh dang! Yeah, see, I'd have to kill them twice. And we're only gonna kill them one more time, anyways. So, well, I guess I save them next time. Hopefully, I'll get uh, you know, more of the shards or whatever. Oops. Oopsies. Can I do it like this? Does it work like that? Yep, it does. Just making this desolation. All these wither fights. Hey, another one shot. Nice. Anything good? See, that wasn't so bad. Dang, that's a lot of levels, though. That was pretty quick. Oh, I did get more nether stars. Did I get, like, a bonus drop or something? Knowledge of death. I didn't even realize my knowledge of death went up. What is my knowledge of death? Oh, zero out of ten. I don't have any levels. Is my Ankh ready? Nope. Damn, I gotta wait for all this XP now. <laughs> uh, well, I guess let's go back home. There's no reason to be out here. Uh, okay, well, I'm waiting for the XP to go down. Let's start crafting some of this stuff. I need this arcane stone. I have none, and I know I'm going to need a lot of it, so... Should probably not be using andesite. Soft stone, blackened stone... Yeah, it should be any kind of stone. I actually don't have a lot of stone. Alright, 32. I think that should be good, right? Source jar. Do we have glass? Yes. We're gonna need a lot of these things. I think 8. Yeah, that should be good. <sighs> we need this volcanic source link. Do I even have a lava bucket? I don't think so, huh? Well... Time to go get some lava. How much of that source stone do I have? Source gem 30 something. Man, my XP is still going. Holy crap. Shift. Shift right clicking. Can't go down the ladder. What happened, guys? <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, I'm like, why is there a cow over here? Well, I guess that uh, answers our question about slowing. He literally just slowed me and I couldn't move at all. So much for the Onk Charm. Who said the Onk Charm was hell OP? Man, whoever said that shit? It's full of shit. You shouldn't listen to that guy. Okay. Uh, should we make two of these? I have no idea if we should make two of these. Stash the lava. Hunting. Ritual brazier. Source gem block. Let's see, what is this thing? Pedestal. 
Source gem block. Brazier. Summon Wilden. Whoa, there's multiple ways to create this. Interesting. Did I need something with XP? Oh yeah, I gotta put in the XP for the stupid coins. Oops. Is that it? There's just three, wasn't it? Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, I think I did it too much. Oops. Okay, uh, we wanted... What do we want? We want the hat. Uh, crystal heart. Let's get that one. And then we want... Golden hook. And then the lucky charms hat. Superstitious hat. Nice. Increases experience dropped by creatures, especially those you have not recently killed. Nice. And then superstitious hat. <laughs> My guy looks ridiculous. Can I turn it off? Oh, you can. Well, I'll keep it on. Look it. And then the crystal heart. 1% attack speed. Belt. I'm missing a ring? Oh, that's right, because I had the dragon uh, thingy on there. Huh. Well, maybe we will... Oh, I just realized I should probably disenchant these. Because we're going to get a bunch of netherite, so we should probably disenchant those. Whoa, why do I have... Oh, it's the hook! I'm like, what happened to my hand? What the hell? <laughs> Dude, that's cool. It's actually like a golden hook. Oh, that's awesome. You can actually see it. Dude, I love it. I wonder if, it, if you switch hands, will it go on the other hand? Oh my god, he thinks of everything. Look at that shit. Dude, that's so cool. I'm going to keep it on because I just like the way it looks. Although it's taking up more of my screen. I'll probably take it off eventually, but... For now, I like the way it looks, so let's do that. Uh, do we still have tones? No, we don't. Uh, let's take that stuff off. Uh, where are my stupid tones? Take off that beef thing. We don't need that anymore. Oh, there it is. Need two of these puppers. Take off mending. Mending. Uh, I guess we'll keep the mending. Let's keep it in the inventory for now. I forgot I need to put all this stuff away. Okay, need to upgrade those rings. Is there anything else we want with diamond coins? Uh, I haven't really seen... Let's look this up. I'm curious if... Will it tell us if there's an emblem? Oh, these emblems. Oh. The hunter ones or whatever. Does it actually do anything though, I wonder? Is it just like a title or something? Interesting. See, I didn't even know about- Oh my god, it's the buddy steel shit? Oh no, it's not. Rare set. I wonder what those do. So that's for buddy cards then. Oh. Holy crap, this is like some kind of super metal or something. Meltor. Somebody, uh, God, what was your name? Hold on, I wrote your name down. I know I did somewhere. Didn't I write your name down? Oh yeah, Dark Becerra. He was saying we should look into the buddy, the buddy card mod. If any of you guys know about the buddy card mod, please tell me in the comments. Um, it just seems like you just collect cards and then like you add them together and you get stronger or something. Uh, I know that, what's his face, Dreams has this thing over here, where is it, this thing, I'm pretty sure it'll probably teach you how to use it correctly, if I just read the buddy card book, but, you know, I'm lazy, and I don't want to read all this crap, so if anybody can just give me the, you know, give me the Sparknotes version, um, I want to look into it eventually, I just haven't done it, and I just realized right now, did this heart thing give me, like, five hearts? Yeah, it did, whoa. Right? 
Hey, now we can test out that heal spell that I never use. There you go. It worked. Cool. Yeah, it was like five hearts it gave me. That's pretty good. Uh, Let's clear the inventory. Let's get all this crap out of here. Okay. Oops, I forgot about that. Dude, I feel like I'm way faster. What the hell happened? Why am I faster? <laughs> Did I get some kind of buff that gave me speed or something? Is it just because of this hat? No, I'm still pretty fast. I just have speed level one from my the bunny buff. <laughs> I'm just like, what the fuck happened? Was it this from my scythe? Huh. I don't know. I just feel like a lot faster. That's weird. Oh, I have a buff for more hearts. That must have been from the food. Okay, uh, what were we gonna do again? I already forgot. My goldfish memory. Uh, let's put this in here. I should probably get rid of a lot of this crap. Those gloves? We don't need those. Okay, so. We need- whoa, this thing glows? Whoa. Cool. It, like, burns stuff or something? They said you could, like, put coal in it or something? I just wanna see how it works. Let's see if we can- or just stuff. Oh, I think stuff has to be like near it. It would probably help if we read the thingy, you know? Generates by consuming burnable items. Archwitch logs. Spawning log. Automatically outputs to nearby jars. Take items from surrounding pedestals. Like consuming burnable items. Does that mean like you throw it at it? I gotta take off my dang ring. I forgot. Can I? Can be disabled by holding shift. I think sneak, right? Yeah, it looks like it's eating it up. Huh. Okay, so now we gotta probably put the source jars. Alright, we're taking off the ring. I need to take this shit off. Nice. I have a feeling this is probably gonna give me a bunch of source. Let's just put them all down. 25% full. Hey, I'm down for that. Oh my god, I should probably use all that wood I have. Jesus, I have so much wood. It's like a stupid amount of wood. Uh, what is it again? Log? There we go. Not oak log, not spruce log. Throw it all down. This is nice. This is way better than uh, using the plant one, which reminds me while we're waiting for these things to fill up. Oh, let's make those ritual tablets. Didn't I have tablets? Look at I do have tablets. Fertility, overgrowth, blight, nah. Nothing good. Okay, let's do... Uh, where the hell are they? Oh, here they are. Oh, that's right. Okay, what do I have the most of? Probably this one, right? Ah, oh, dang it, I forgot. I need that stupid wood. Vexing archwood log. That's the red one, isn't it? I found a lot of those. Source gem block. Well. I guess while this is running, we can go get some of those... Those trees. Can you actually grow the trees? Or I don't know how that works. I've never actually chopped them down or anything. I'm curious if you can actually grow them. They seem like they're kind of important for Ars Novo, but... I know I found some. Yeah, see, look, at here's this... Is that a blue one and a red one, or is it just a blue one? Oh, maybe that is both. It is. Oh, no, this is blazing. Cascading. What the hell is vexing? Is that only, like, in the nether or something? Vexing. 
kind of tempted to take this. I know I found... Oh, there it is. Nice. I was like, I know I found some weird trees before. Archwood trees. I'm assuming that you can grow these, because look at they have saplings. So I'm assuming that I can chop these down and, you know, grow a tree from it. They look pretty. I love the texture of the wood. I'm curious, can you actually make planks out of this? I mean, I don't see why you wouldn't be able to make planks. Where'd planks at? I don't see no planks. Alright, I'm over it. I'll look some other time. I yeah, see, look at There's one, one. Oh, I forgot I was supposed to go back and check that. We should go do that to Crocosark. Which one is Crocosark? That one? Nice. There she blows. Well, well, well. Should I chop down the whole thing? Hmm. Yeah, let's do it. Do we need to put like four of them together like usual, you know? Let's try it out. Nice, we got six saplings. We got our fancy unlimited bone meal. Aha, it worked. Ooh, so each one makes a big old tree. Interesting. Who the hell are you? Cool. That's pretty dirty. I thought we we're gonna have to use, I thought they were gonna like, I don't know, use a spell or something just to Just to make the trees grow. Oh, I forgot. I don't have my ring on. I'm like, why do I have to like... <laughs> that ring is very nice. If you don't have that magnet ring, you should get it. Because it makes your life so much better. It really does. Let's plant extra trees. I'm not going to come back here, I don't think. Oh, dang it. But I need this red one. I only got one red sapling. Oh, wait. Because of this. Duh. I just realized, hey, look, I'm not here to fight. All right, woman. Can we, like, just relax? All right. And we'll put another vexing one. That's pretty OP. That's a lot of wood from one sapling. Oops. Look at those flowers, though. Give me those. What biome is this? A meadow? Yeah, let me get some of those. Pink pansies. I don't remember if you can plant the pink pansies. I don't remember if they look good or not when you put them in planters. That looks good though. I want some of the big shrubs. Ooh, look at that rose. That rose is hot. I gotta do a building video. Like I haven't done any like building in a long time. I feel like I've been so obsessed to just like making progression in the mod pack, then I'm like, dude, I gotta, like, take a break and go build. But I guess it's a good thing, because kind of in the beginning, I was like, eh, this mod pack's okay. Like, I wasn't really sure what to do, you know, in the beginning. Uh, and now I feel like I really figured out, like, what you should be doing correctly. I still haven't even gone to the other dimensions. People have been telling me about the other dimensions, and I'm like, dude, I still, I still haven't even gone. I'm still doing shit in the vanilla dimensions. Uh, okay, so we got that, so let's go back home.
Did you finish? Dang, it ate up everything, huh? Or did the stuff get deleted? That's all you got? It's one and a half? I kind of find that hard to believe. I feel like it bugged out or something. Let's see. I don't believe you. You ate up all that wood and you only gave me one jar. One and a half jars. Show me. 2%, huh? Maybe it did. Hmm. Alright, we'll leave that going. Uh, oh yeah. We need to make the tablets. Let's put all this stuff away. We should probably plant these trees. We should plant some of these in our garden back here. That would look nice. Where's the red one? There it is. That would look very nice. I want to spruce up that back area and make it all look nice, but you know, you know how it is. It's on the list. Another reason why I got to just like do a building episode and just build shit. Um, maybe I should do that for the next episode. Hmm. I'm thinking I want to get this netherite stuff done for sure and try this out. But maybe after that we will do a building episode or something. Damn, I think it did eat up all that wood. Can't tell. Looks like there's only two stacks left. This thing's a hog. I wonder if I can use lava. Can I use lava? Well, I mean, I guess I have a shitload of coal, so it's not like... I mean, come on. It's not like we're hurting. Oh, I forgot about this underground bastion. I need to do that, too. All right, let's see. No, not that one. Dang it. Do this one because it gives us one of each. Tablet of scrying. And then we needed a glyph of extend time. That's what the guy was saying. Tier two clock. Should probably put that on here. Put it on my bookmarks because I have a feeling we're going to be using that a lot. Glyph of extend time. I am pretty sure I have a clock, don't I? Yes. Yes. 70% full. Um, yeah, I seen, I tried looking up about dragons too, because I was curious to see, uh, what was the best way to find dragons. And... Um, based off this idea from, God, what was your name again? <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, Nikolai, that's it was. Based off this idea from Nikolai, I think probably the best way to find dragons, people were saying these dragon eyes, I guess you get, you can get the heart and make these eyes to find more of the same type of dragon. See, look, it's still going. It's almost out though. It's like there's only one stack left. So I guess it did eat up everything then. Hmm. Uh, anyways, about the dragon eyes, they were saying you could use these to find them. This is the correct in-game way you're supposed to, uh, find, you know, more dragons. But, um, I guess people were saying it's kind of buggy and it doesn't always work. So, I was thinking, based off of what Nikolai was saying, I haven't even told you the whole process. Hold up. So, so the whole process is basically, we use this ritual brazier, it makes this tablet of scrying, and then we throw in one of these ancient debris and it'll basically and this glyph of extend time and it'll basically give us like an x-ray buff that will show us where ancient debris is nearby and then you just go mine a bunch of ancient debris so it's like a way to find blocks like you know to try and give yourself x-ray vision to find specific blocks with this uh tablet of scrying or this ritual of scrying so based off of uh nikolai's idea you should technically be able to find dragons like underground dragons because if you've ever killed dragons before, usually there's like charred stone, it's called. I forget what it's called exactly. It's like burnt stone or something. It looks black. And that's what the dragon dens are made out of underground. So you would just have to find at least one underground dragon, get some of that charred stone. And then you should, I would imagine, be able to use the tablet of scrying. And you should be able to find dragons that way underground. Because it would give you the x-ray vision and then you could find them, you know. 
But we need to test out. Uh, we need to test out this whole process with the ritual first, with the ancient debris, and then maybe we can, you know, we could try it out. Let's try out this uh, wilden guy first, because I do. You know what? Let's do him after. I want my netherite. Let's get the netherite for sure. Okay, so he said. Hallow's ring. Uh, I'm putting on my ring. He was saying not to use the ring because you're going to pick up a bunch of netherrack, but I don't really care. I'll just throw it away. And watch, I say that right now, and then watch in like a minute, I'm going to be bitching and be like, oh, God, it's netherrack. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, let's go. Dang it. I forgot about the stupid step up mod. I really need to fix that portal and make it look nice. <laughs> it looks so jank. There's a lot of things we gotta do. Alright, let's head down. And let's get my computer to melt. Another thing that I need to do. Fix this stupid staircase so that way I can use my leap spell. <laughs> Someday. Maybe when I make that tier 3 explosion spell, when I get the tier 3 uh, spell book, I'm just going to use it to blow this tunnel up and make it go straight. So I can fly down here. Are you a bad guy? Aren't you bad? Are you going to hit me, bro, or what? <sighs> Alright, hold on. Let's get rid of these guys, because I feel like they're, they're going to be bugging. Oh, I forgot about you. Can I still trade you? Oh, yes, I can. Okay. Uh, I got a lot of crap. Oh, look at that. Nether coin. Uh, we'll try that out in a bit. Let's first. Breaking research edge. No. Okay. So they said. You put the ritual down. And then you put the scrying tablet. Oh, there you go. Extend time. Item consumed. Glyph of extend time. Now what? Did it give me it? The hell is it doing? Is it on? <laughs> oh, that was the ritual. Ah oh, shit, I forgot to put on the stupid ancient debris. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Oh my god, you idiot. <laughs> I just used the spell, but I forgot to put on the ancient debris. Fuck. That's what it was work like waiting for. Oops. Ay yeah yeah, I got to go make this thing again. Hold up. Oh wait, I can just do it here. Tablet of scrying. I didn't understand what was going on. I was like, what's going on? Am I all out of these gems? Oh, no, I'm not. Okay. And my poor extend time. Damn it. I need to go do that. Hold on. Let's go back home. I can't even teleport like this. That's what I get. Fast click and John strikes again. That's what I get for not reading. I'm reading lol. All right, want the glyph of extend time. <laughs> God. That was a waste. Clock. Stupid tablet of scrying. Oh, I'm missing the gem. I'm seriously going to have to get source gems. Look at I'm like basically out. Okay, we're gonna read the instructions this time. <laughs> we're gonna read what, uh, what was his name? Nikolai said. We'll go read Nikolai's comment. To see exactly what I'm supposed to do. Cause I'm over here, not even following directions. Okay, so he said, 
go down to layer 10 to 15, place the ritual, throw an ancient debris in it, and a glyph of extended time will give you 15 minutes of x-ray. And that's it. It's not too bad. Alright, we got our glyph extend time. Let's not waste this scrying thing again. Are you a new guy? Can you, like, get down here? No anvil? Well, at least I have a little bit of iron for you. I haven't been mining in forever. Alright. Back again. <laughs> here we go. Goddamn auto jump. I wonder if I should, I should probably dispel myself. I'm so paranoid. I don't want this thing to like screw up and then I just wasted my time again. There you go. Dispel myself. Arcane bolt. What was I using last time? I guess just the light spell. All right. Do this again. Man, what the hell happened? Last time there was nobody over here. Dude, I love this guy's hat. What the hell? I thought you guys were hostile. Last time they were attacking me. Maybe because I killed some of them, probably. <laughs> okay. Ritual Brazier. Uh, I don't know if I need a source thingy, but let's just put it down anyways. Oh wait, I forgot. I gotta take off my stupid ring. Okay. He said, scrying tablet? I already forgot what he said. <laughs> Let me go look again. <laughs> what did he say? He said, scrying tablet. Okay, place the ritual. Place the ritual, throw an ancient debris in a glyph of extended time. So I'm assuming you have to put the, the tablet first. Yes, okay. Ancient debris. Oops, am I supposed to throw it? Did it just like eat it up or what? Oh yeah, items consume ancient debris glyph of extend time. Awaiting activation. There we go. Now it says running. See, if I actually just read what it said, I would have known. But, you know, didn't read lol. Items consume ancient debris glyph of extend time. Nice. Now we have scrying. Oop, there it is. Oh my god, right above me. Look at this shit. Uh, I forget. We needed fortune too. Doesn't fortune like give you higher, higher whatever? Dude, look at this shit. Dirty. This is cheating. Look at this baby. Oops. I didn't want to do that. There you have it, folks. Mr. Nikolai was correct. Ritual of scrying. Most OP ass shit ever. Except when I get stuck by gravel. Well, I didn't realize I was already standing on this. Now I just need to dig. Got this soul sand. Getting a little annoying. That's what I was worried about. Goddamn lava. A lot of lava. Good thing we have... Blah. Can I just get this ancient debris? Can I do that, please? I hope it didn't break. 15 minutes, huh? I almost can't see because it's so bright. It messes with my eyes. Look at all this. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's get the white ones first.
This is so dirty. 20 ancient debris. It's weird, it's not showing those ones that were far away now. I wonder if you could put another glyph of extend time. Give you even more time to mine. I already got 28, which is pretty good. find <laughs> I was about to say hopefully we don't find lava and we found lava ooh we're under a lava lake that might not be good seems it's kind of wonky this x-ray thing it seems like like work sometimes and other times it's like you have to walk around a bit for it to properly process have I been on fire this whole time and I just not noticed so I'm too busy trying to look at the The ancient debris. Oh, okay, no, I haven't. Does fortune affect the ancient debris? I'm not really sure. Yes, it does. This guy said he got like 200 or something. Uh, Nikolai said he got like 200 ancient debris like in 15 minutes. I'm like god damn dude. Where were you mining? <laughs> like, I'm already five minutes in I only got 39 Maybe using fortune doesn't matter with the ancient debris. Well, I'm gonna do it anyways. Fifty, okay, that's good. Three. Too shabby. Man, now I see how rare this shit really is. It's kind of gross. Look at how far away I am now. Oh my god. Eight minutes left. I think we got a good one over here. Nice. Oh, lava. Did it melt? Oh no, I don't think so.
Nikolai was saying too to make sure you mine netherite uh, or nether quartz so that way you can uh, get XP, you know, for your mending. This is a small thing. It looks like my tools are pretty much okay, but I guess if you were seriously digging like crazy, then yeah. He could have been also, maybe he had an AoE upgrade or something on his, uh, his pick. So it's probably eating through a lot more durability than mine. Or maybe he wasn't. Who knows? So it looks like also it didn't even use any of my source too. That's so OP. It doesn't even take source. That's like, whoa. All it takes is just the, ri the ritual, extend time. One ancient debris. Like, I remember seeing there's a bunch over here. Blackstone. Well, that's pretty cool. We will definitely use this ritual. What was it again for the ritual? Oh, yeah, just the source gem block. And the glowstone, but eh, we have a lot of glowstone. The wizard. What's that? Witches love you? Oh. Not interested. I was literally about to say, you know, we haven't really found that much lava considering. <laughs> like, dude, every time I think about it, I'm just like, uh, my self-cursing magic powers never fail. How much lava is there? God damn, dude. An actual, like, lava vein. There's more higher up. Oops. That might be dangerous. Nikolai, you must have gotten super lucky, man. I'm barely going to hit. I'm not even probably going to get two stacks from this. But still way better. I'm not complaining. I'm just saying. Trust me, this is way better. I agree with Nikolai. This is way better. This is hands down the best way probably to find... To find uh, ancient debris, but... I'm like, man, Nikolai, I want to know where you were mining, dude. Three minutes left. 
Alright, cool. So we will hit two stacks. That's pretty good. Hey, still much better. Much better than trying to find all this shit normally. It's taking me like months to find this much netherite or ancient debris. Two minutes left. One minute. This is such a pretty song. Thirty five seconds we could get this one. Can we get some more? I'm just like digging in circles, like spinning my mouse wheel around. 18 seconds. Ten. Now well, we can get this guy. And we're out. Dang. Well, still pretty good. Two and a half stacks almost. Pretty fucking good, all things considering. Look at how far away we are. So yes, Mr. Nikolai, everybody do what Nikolai said. Cause this shit works. Uh only issue is I gotta uh get back. I wonder if I can use Fellow Rider. I think that's the one, isn't it? Can I use my hearthstone to teleport within Within the nether? I would imagine, right? I've never done it before. Oh, nice. You can. Sweet. I want to head back to my... Oops. I want to head back to my place over here because there was a... A nether goblin or whatever they're called. Lava goblin? I don't know what they're called. It was somewhere over here. Where my uh, mine was. There we go. Is this it? Yeah, this is it. So we can at least get a little bit more ancient debris. Because if you don't know, you can trade the goblin for ancient debris. And he'll give you one extra uh, netherite scrap than normally. Because normally if you do the recipe, you only get four. But if you do Mr. Gobelino. Ooh, good thing I came back. So I could have got my ritual brassiere. I almost forgot about that. Uh, Mr. Gobelino will give you five instead of four, like the recipe. So, pretty cool. Where'd you go? Did he seriously just despawn as soon as I got here? <laughs> Where'd you go, damn it? <laughs> Wasn't he there? Oh my god, that's what I get for not talking to him. I thought you were aggroed. Yeah, you were aggroed. I thought there was another one. Oh, here's one. Nice, Mister. See, look at that. Boom. Oh my God, he traded all of it. Holy shit. 
That's crazy. I thought the trade was going to expire or something. Like, really fast. But that was not fast at all. That was super quick. I wonder if I should, uh... Yeah, we have a ton of emeralds. Let's buy some stuff. Come on, reset that trade. Oh, wait. Doesn't it have to, like... I forgot. Doesn't he have to, like, go to sleep or something to reset trades? I forgot how reset trading works. Or trading resets. Okay, well, that's still good. That's a shitload of netherite scrap. Look at that. <laughs> I'm gonna have a heart attack. Uh, I kind of want to kill him. There's another one. Oh my god, thank god you're here. Woohoo, look at that shit. Oh, it takes four. I was like, how come he didn't take it? Oh, that's actually good that we... Oh my god, that would have been disastrous if I traded all that. Oh, don't make my mistake, guys. <laughs> that was really close call. If I would have just traded him that ancient debris, I would have had to go find ancient debris again. Oh god, that would have been terrible. Was this the guy I was talking to? No. Where'd the other one go? Maybe he had something good and I didn't even see. Dang, guys, they just like book it as soon as you stop talking to them. He's out of here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You are a super elite. Guys, too. Look at that. Nether coins. I forgot about that. We need to do that, too. We need to use those nether coins. And see what's up. Let's... And I can't teleport back. Oh, so nice to climb up this so fast. <sighs> Man, this is so nice. It's like... This is life changing, guys. Life changing. You're still here? To get all that nether scrap. Look at that. Oh my god. That's a lot. Uh, okay. What's the recipe again? I don't even remember. Oh yeah, just gold. Dude. Dude, bro. I got this. Uh, I don't even remember what. How much nether I do? <laughs> Nitger. 198. So that's like, uh, three stacks. Because we need a nether block for. How much gold do I have? Do I even have enough gold? Ooh, might be low on gold. We need two to upgrade the two bracelets I have. I need one for my backpack. And I need a total of nine for another right block to upgrade one of the bracelets and another nine for the other bracelet. How much do I got left? 118. Okay, that's pretty good. Uh, all right. Finally, we're going to upgrade our poor backpack. I remember I put it off all those like episodes ago. Oops, not this one. This one, right? Yeah. Oh, it doesn't even take anything. Nice. I remember I put off upgrading my backpack and I actually regretted it. I only got one extra slot. <laughs> uh, oh, no. And I have to move everything over. Shit. I'm so ungrateful. <laughs> one extra row and I'm complaining. Amen. One extra row is better than no extra rows. I just wanted, you know, at least like two. At least like two extra rows. That would have been nice. I gotta move over this no sort thing too. Uh, where's the options? No sort. What do I do? Hold shift? Oh no, right click. That's what it was. 
right click and then there okay cool I need to level up my alchemy so I can use that pearl of the void 35% chance you no longer need air to breathe. Immunity to any status effect. That's crazy. Uh, okay, what else can we do? I want to upgrade these rings. Let's do that. Let's see what happens when we upgrade it. Because I got jump boost when I upgraded this to a blue, I think. Oh, Jesus. I just realized my XP has been going up this whole time. Resistance and jump boost, so it didn't get anything else. Okay, that's fine. I honestly would be totally fine if just even had resistance. I would be okay. Actually, before we make this, before I throw that much netherite on this thing, let's look at bracelet. Uh, archery. Interesting. So this is the only bracelet. It's just the archery XP boost. Or does it actually have enchants on it, I wonder? Hmm. I'm trying to think what other enchants, before I drop all this netherite on this thing, I'm trying to think of what other enchants would be really good. But, I don't know, I feel like... I think strength, maybe? Like, that's maybe the only other thing I could think of? Haste? Resistance, I feel like, is so important because of the legendaries and all that. It would be really nice to have a ton of resistance. I was actually reading on the Minecraft wiki. I didn't even realize that you could get super high resistance with, like, stacking potion effects and shit. And I guess if you have 10 resistance, you actually are immune to damage. So I'm like, man, I kind of want to be a dirty motherfucker and just, like... I would have two bracelets of resistance and then maybe get two rings of resistance. But then I would lose my... What am I using on my necklace? Because what if there's two rings, two bracelets, and then a necklace, right? I think that's all from this mod. Oh, that's right. Charm, ring, necklace, body. Oh, and I have these slots taken. So I could put on one more ring then. If I wanted to be a true, if I want to be a real sweaty motherfucker, I could take off my magnet ring when I'm fighting and put on another resistance. I don't know if I want to be that sweaty, though. It's pretty sweat. You could be real sweat like that. Resistance jump boost. That's cool. It has max health on it. All right, let's see what happens. <gasps> Look at that. Water breathing. Oh my god. So I wonder if it's random or is it based off of the item? See, that's what's very interesting to me. Because if we're not going to get another resistance from this bracelet, I'm curious to see what other bracelet would give resistance as a benefit. Because if that's the case... I'm kind of thinking we might, we should probably get some of these other bracelets that have strength or speed or haste or whatever, and we should upgrade them to see what's the other upgrades we're going to get. Because I don't really care about water resistant or water breathing and jump boost. So let's do that. See, I knew it. I knew there was some neckbeard shit I could do. <laughs> I knew it. Okay. We're going to do some fucking science right now. See, let's get the luck one. Fuck it, let's get the jump boost too. I mean, whatever. Uh, speed. I see the pattern of what's going on here. I wonder if it's based off of the gem. Hmm. Let's do some science. We'll sacrifice another netherite. Oh, man, I think I'm going to run out of netherite ingots, though. Because it takes, what, four? And I have 100, so I have 25 more netherite ingots. Okay, I could upgrade 25 more of those thingies. That would be fine. Ah, I forgot about the diamond block, though. I think I'm going to run out of diamond. 
Because that's what it takes just for one. It's like, dang. That's a lot. That's kind of an expensive science project I'm doing right now. I'm going to have to actually go mining for diamond or something. Well, I guess I could do our uh, fancy schmancy scrying tablet and I can just use that to go find like a million diamond really fast. And then with fortune, I'd be able to really easily be able to get it. Hmm. I need to get that fortune five too. Hold on. Let's look at that before I forget. Because I can give it to a gobelino, a diamond pick plus fortune three book. And he will give you a fortune five. Yes, sir. I have it. Nice. Okay. Speak of the devil and he shall appear. <laughs> My good man, do you have it? Ah, he only has efficiency. That's cool. You can get efficiency six. That's nice. I'm kind of tempted to do that right now since he's here. I should take advantage, huh? I have efficiency four. Do I have an efficiency five? Oh, wait, what was it? Five, right? That's what you needed. Efficiency five. Okay. Do I even have five? No, not you. Efficiency. Oh, yep, I'll have enough. Oh, it's only efficiency four. Dang it. Do I have enough? Yes, sir, I do. Good thing I got distracted by this. And then I just need a diamond, whatever. I don't have like a shovel. I don't have anything that's not enchanted. Well, I'm just going to make a diamond shovel because I don't want to spend more diamond. I'm already going to spend a lot of diamond right now. Diamond that I barely have. Diamond shovel. Where the hell'd you go? Dude, bro! Where'd you go? Oh, thank god. Hey. That's it, right? Yeah, efficiency six. Noise. So he doesn't have the luck one. But whatever. At least he has that. I should probably just disenchant one of these diamond picks, right? Ecological. Yeah, I'm just going to disenchant this. Here is Tome. Disenchant this pupper. So we'll keep this with us. So next time we see a goblin, we need to give him this so we can get fortune five. So that we can break the game and get hella... Hella, hella, hella. Get hell of fortune. Let's look at that. We already got efficiency six now. From this buster. Now we can use efficiency six. Alright. Uh, after that little side distraction. Now back to science. Oops, I forgot about my XP. <laughs> Again. Time to do some science. Okay, um, I'm curious to see if I were to upgrade this. We need to test if it's going to get the same one because these have different. This is a golden bracelet. This is a silver one with the yellow thingy. This is a gold one with the green thingy. Let's see if the icons even matter. I have a feeling that they don't even matter. <gasps> oh, no, science. <laughs> Regen and resistance? Oh no. Oh, I'm so full of shit. So it's just random then. Every time you upgrade. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Science. <laughs> Every time you upgrade one of these, it gets just a random one. So it's not set in stone then. <gasps> oh my god. That is very interesting. This is a really fucking good bracelet. Because it has regen and resistance. I could try and gamble and get something else that has something better, but like... Dude. Regen and resistance? Give me that shit. And it's unbreakable. Look at that. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, it didn't stack with my food regen though. That's fucked up. It just like deleted my food regen. 
water breathing. So yeah, see, look at this one's just jacked then. It doesn't have... Okay, so now that we know this, we're not even gonna fuck around and we're just gonna only do stuff that has resistance on it because I want resistance. So there's really no reason to even bother upgrading something that doesn't have resistance. This is the starter enchant that we have on it. Okay. So, oops, I forgot about the netherite. Uh, let's make some more netherite ingots. Six. How much more do I got? I'm gonna have to do this ritual again. 94. Okay, we're good. Okay. So. So this one's kind of like whatever, because I'm only gonna get water breathing on it. So I feel like that's a junk one. I wish I could disenchant this or scrap it. So I can get some of my netherite back. All right, which one am I going to do? Uh, my gut's leaning towards this one. Let's do it. Uh, got luck. Mm. Eh, I don't really care about luck. Man, this is such a gamble. I guess it's only diamonds that I'm gambling with, but still. Ugh. We got it, baby. We got it. Second try, and we fucking got it. Oh my god. <laughs> Give me that. Regen and resistance. Oh my god. Look at this. Dirty ass shit. Oh, you can only have one level of regen. Boo! Well. Uh, see, that changes things. If you can only have one level of regen. Man, I didn't know that. What else would I want then? Well, resistance for sure. Let's see if we could put on a resistance ring. And, uh, you know, will it stack or am I going to be capped at only three? Let's see. Yep, you're stacked. You're capped at two. Damn. Okay. Well, I mean, it makes sense. It's fair. It would be OP to be able to stack up a bunch of resistance like that and break the game. That sucks. We can't have more than one region. Ah, <sighs> I feel like I wasted all that netherite then. Okay. Since we can't have another region. Man, that sucks. I feel bad now. I wasted that netherite. Since we can't have another region, what would be the next best shit? Uh, probably strength, right? Hold on, let's go look. On the Minecraft wiki. I don't actually know how much damage does strength increase it by. It increases melee damage by three in Java edition. That's only one and a half hearts. That's kind of like, eh. I feel like it's not that big of a deal. I mean, it helps. It's, I'm not going to say it doesn't. Would it be better to have haste then? Nah, probably speed so I could run faster. Luck. Jump boost. Haste, resistance, strength. I don't care about luck. I already have max. Yeah, probably just speed, right? I mean... Anything else is kind of like whatever. Uh, okay. We did have the other bracelet slot, right? Yes. Okay. Well, here we go again. Let's gamble. Oops. Time to gamble again. Resistance and luck. Blah. Resistance and speed, baby. Hell yeah, let's do it. That's what I should have done in the first place. I should have just... Uh, dang it, I need that to the right book. Now I think I'm almost out of netherite, huh? 58, okay, I still have a decent amount. Not too bad. I like it. Uh, where are you at? Resistance and speed. Oh man, that's really OP. And I don't want night vision. Damn it. Ugh. That's fucked up. They got me. <laughs> man, I don't want night vision. That would be annoying having to take that shit off every time. Like, it's nice, but, uh 
I don't want that. That's fucked up. <laughs> Here I was celebrating. They got me, guys. They got me. Resistance and luck. Well, let's try again. Do we have another resist? I mean, I guess the good thing is these. It's not like these things are hard to get. Resistance and speed. Uh, yeah, let's put that there. I didn't realize we had so many of them. Resistance. I'm over here complaining. It's like, dude, you got a ton. All right. Ah, nice. Resistance and speed. Please be not night vision, please. I just don't want night vision. Oh my god, it doesn't grin. Okay, so it must be... It must be tied to this, then. Hmm. Okay, I'm over gambling. I need to take a break from all this gambling. So it must be tied to this... There must be only a set number of variables. So if you get one that has resistance and speed, it's going to be guaranteed that it's going to have night vision on the third one. That's already the second one in a row. I mean, I could be wrong, and the third one won't be like that. Could just be confirmation bias, but... I'm tired of gambling, so I'm not going to do that anymore. I'm just going to stick with my crappy one that has resistance, and... <laughs> now that I'm looking at it, I'm like, dude, you really got to replace that. You basically had two wasted buffs on this thing. Regen and luck. Uh, that bugs me. It's nice that we have two uh, resistance, but that's something I am going to have to fix. <sighs> another day, another day, we'll fix it. But for now, let's go get that Wilden. Let's go kill Senor Wilden. And, ooh, I forgot about the nether coins. We need to check that too. Let's leave that there. We need to do the nether coins. Look at all that gold we got. What is this? Jump boost. I forgot about all that mending too we got. Mending. Alright, there's the ritual. Summon Wilden. All these dang books. I wonder if this one's gonna take source or not. Ender marksman. Plenish durability and grant your arrow back. Whoa. Cool. Alright, I think we're good. Where's the goblin? I hear him. Forgot, we need to put flowers over there. All right, let's go fight the Wilden. I have no idea what the Wilden does. Oh, there you are. How did you get in there? Can you come out so I can trade you? I think this is the same guy. Yeah, it is. All right, let's go. I hope the Wilden doesn't break stuff, because I'm going to be pissed if he starts breaking my arena. Dude, you scared me, Mr. Roadrunner. I was about to fucking whack your ass. Last eaten 11 meals ago. Look at that eternal steak. Oh my god. So nice. You guys need to get this if you don't have it. This thing is so nice. Alright, let's see if Mr. Wilden... Awaiting activation. Was that him? <laughs> okay, there's another one. What in the hell is that? Wild and Defender? Uh, what happened? Did I do the wrong one? Crap, I think I did the wrong one. <laughs> Oops. I forgot. Didn't they say something? See ritual of summoning Wilden. Damn it! 
<laughs> uh, so I maybe didn't read again. Uh, yeah, I didn't read. Didn't read, lol. I remember I read this last time. I totally forgot about it. Oops. Augmented. Uh, Search will summon the wild and chimera. Challenging. Oh, so you need to augment it with all these things. Spike, horn, and wing. It will summon the wild and chimera. Ritual will will destroy blocks around the brazier. Ooh, good thing I read that. <laughs> All right. Let's try this again. Uh, oh, yeah, I need all those, right? Wilden. One, two, three. And we need our stupid ritual. Oh, no, they got us. <laughs> oh damn it I forgot <laughs> uh, my fault all right let's we finally can't put it off anymore we gotta find us some source gems which we just did eh. six let's be irresponsible and just take the six and you know we can mine them next time. Hold on, let's put that on the list. Okay. We need to mine diamond. Use scrying ritual. And we need to mine source gems. Maybe we'll use scrying ritual? Probably should. I feel like the scrying ritual is going to make me really lazy now. Or I'm just like, dude, I'll just use the scrying ritual all the time. Like, what do we need to make it again? I don't think it's too bad, right? Yeah, it's just the source gems. That's like nothing. I have all this crap. That's like, that's nothing. That's so easy to do. Damn it, I took off the Ritual of the Wilden. Where is this one? Dang it, it used all those. Okay. Oops. I thought I needed that source gem block. Oh, that was only for the ritual of scrying. Oops. So I didn't need the source gem to begin with. Okay, let's read it again. Okay. Without augments, the ritual will summon a random variety of wild and monsters. When augmented with the ritual spike, wild and horn, wild and wing, this ritual will summon the wild and chimera. So you need spike, horn, and wing. Challenging and destructive. Summoning the Chimera, this ritual will destroy blocks around the Brazier. Man, you better not destroy my Brazier. I don't have to make that shit again. Alright. Let's do this. Uh, where are we going? To our... Our destruction... Destruction spot? Destructo spot? We should probably put a teleporter over there. I'm getting tired of, you know. Let's do it. <sighs> do I want to spend the coins for a teleporter? That I'll only use for boss places. I should probably just make my arena out of obsidian or something. So I don't have to worry about it getting blown up. I'm over here not wanting to buy a waystone. Because I'm being a cheap bastard. And look at I have 2,000. <laughs> look at, I got 2,000 coins. Even though I bought a waystone. I'm still not going to use it. Well I guess it doesn't matter. I still got to get over there right? Great waypoint. Destruction arena? Arena? Before I hop off, after we kill this guy, because we're getting close. Getting close to the two hour mark. Um I'll try and make the tier three spell book. So I want to try out the gliding spell and then somebody has adjusted. Did I write his name down? I think it was Hondo. Yeah, it was Hundo or Hondo, whatever your name is. Uh, he was suggesting to make a mining spell for explosions, but I don't even know if I'm going to use that now that we know about the scrying ritual. It's kind of like whatever. All right. Ritual Brazier. Tablet. Oh, I have to throw it, huh? Oh, nice. I didn't have to take off my ring. 
Okay. Horn spike wing. We put on the tablet. We're good, right? Turn it on. I hope we're good. Dang, that looks fucking cool. Whoa, you look scary. Dude, big ass werewolf. How are you healing? Can you explain to me, sir, how you're healing? Oh, he's like going into another phase, maybe? Oh, Jesus. Did he die? No, he's still there. I forgot I was bleeding. Oh, now he's going into another phase. Yeah, he's healing up. He's lubing up. This guy's buff as hell. Look at him. Dang, he's got like a bunch of crystals on him now. Ooh, nice spikes, bro. Oh god, that's kind of scary. Nice spikes, bro, but you're still dead. That was really cool. Although I beat the shit out of him, it was still a very interesting fight. How he kept changing forms and stuff. And now I have... Senor Tablet. Very good, very good. Alright, alright. I don't want to have to walk back here. I'm putting down the stupid thing. Uh, where am I putting it? That's the issue. Hmm. Hmm. This will put it on this hill. This looks like a nice Minecrafty hill to put it on. I forgot I didn't put mending on my poor axe. I need to put mending on it. I have so much mending now, I should probably just put mending on all that stuff. Alright, what will this be? Uh, destruction arena? Overworld? Did I actually type out overworld on all these, or did I just put OW? Oh, I did type it out, cool. Let's... Delete. I'll put waypoint. Destruction. Alrana. Light purple. Classic. Cool. Very cool. Very cool. Should I just use my mirror? I always forget to use my mirror. I use it, I've been using it more often than I usually do, but... I forgot that time. Okay, ah, damn it, I forgot. Because I have most of my spells. <sighs> I use only this one for leap spell. This is the one that has all my spells on it. So I'm probably gonna have to fight another Wilden. So that way I can... Darn. Probably gonna have to fight another one so I can upgrade this other spell book. Because I want the gliding spell. This is jacked up. And I need a wither star. Ugh. <laughs> Don't I have one? No. Why? I just left and I forgot I had to get another nether star. Damn it! Alright. <laughs> you know what time it is. Ooh, those are our last three wither skulls, too. I'm gonna have to farm wither skulls. Uh, let's put that on the list, too. Farm wither skulls. We need it. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's go fight the wither. And let's just take the stuff with us. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I can always just use my storage. Did I put the, oh, there it is. Totem up, I'm dying. Yeah, I'll just leave it in there, whatever. Okay, back we go. Oh, it's getting dark.
Well, I guess we're fighting the wither in the dark. I'm too lazy to wait to get uh for it to get dark so I can go to sleep. Three hits to kill you? Nether Star Shard. Anything good? Ooh, I did get another Nether Star. Noise. Dirty. Alright, let's do... There's that recipe. Just surround it. Yeah, look at that. Nice. Very cool. All right, I can teleport back, right? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I have the teleporter now. All right, let's do this recipe. Let's put my other one. I was gonna, I was about to do it and I'm like, wait, I don't want to mix this up. Let's do this one. I'll do it like this. Totem of Undying. That's my leap one. Here goes nothing. I didn't even get a achievement for that? What? Probably because I don't have progression? Well, he only has one for the Nova spell book. Huh. Dang, I didn't realize he had XP in here. Flying, archery. What the hell does flying even do, I wonder? Source berry roll. I'm down, I'll take it. Wixie? Wild and wing. I haven't looked at any of this stuff in so long. Dude, I have those. I could turn those in right now. Anyways. Man, I'm hungry. That looks good right now. Some kind of pastry? Okay. So. We need to make... Cliff of Glide, Elytra. Need that. That. And an Elytra. Where's the crappy Elytras? Didn't I have one that I disenchanted? I thought I left one in here and I disenchanted it. Did I already make the rune? Crap, I think I made the rune already. Oh, I did. Whew! Never mind, I was about to waste another Elytra. Oops. Well, at least I got some mythical clay. I have a feeling I'm gonna forget about it if I chuck it in here. I'm probably gonna forget about it. <laughs> and next time I make something, I'll be like, Oh, I don't got no mythical clay. Uh, okay. So. Glide. Grants the glide effect. Allowing, allowing the wearer to fly as if they were wearing an Elytra. So does that mean we're going to have to have two separate spells? Like one for jumping to get us in the air and then another one for gliding? Ooh, yeah, see, look at that. Oh, so it's only an effect then. Well, let's see what happens. So it's it's like a buff then? Why do I have this Grinch thing? Is it just the slow fall that's... Whoa. Okay. You haven't figured it out yet. I don't know how to use an L truck because I've never used one. Seems like it's working as I intended. I wonder if it would be better if we took off the slow fall. 
Yeah, it's hell OP. This shit is OP. Okay, let's try taking off the slow fall. Let's see if that makes it better. Slow fall. Leap, amplify, glide. All right, let's create this. Now it doesn't sound like I'm gliding though. I'm gonna have to probably like look up a tutorial how the hell to glide because I don't know how to glide. <laughs> Do you have to like sneak or something? Not in a mana, dang it, I wasn't paying attention to my mana. Let's see it real fast. See, I'm totally showing how much of a Minecraft noob I am. Like, Elytra? What's that? Never used one. Uh, flying speed and altitude. Press the jump key while falling. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Flying can be stopped. Okay, I didn't even know you had to click space. You just hold it? I feel like I had more control. I feel like I had more control when I had the slow fall on. Looks cool though. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm like kind of torn. I don't know whether I should put on the slow fall with it or... Hmm. I have to do more testing. Amplify, glide. Okay. Oops. Man, where the hell am I? Yeah, it's really nice because of this. You can basically just fly and glide forever. It's pretty fucking nice. Now I'm just curious if we can add anything else to the spell, like if we can add speed or something, if that would increase our speed. Or putting on like Amplify 2, for example. Let's try it out. I have a lot more mana now. Ooh, yeah, that's a lot better. I have a lot more mana now, so... I can afford to actually use Amplify 2, but... Still don't like, I can only use it like 10 times maybe, and then I run out of mana, and I don't like that. It's nice how much faster it is with Amplify 2, but... What the hell is that? Oh, just a bunch of harpies. Yeah, it's nice having Amplify 2, but I feel like... Because of my mana, it's still not the greatest. I mean, it's a lot better than it was, but... I feel like... Let's see, how many times can I cast it in one? How many times can I cast it in one mana bar? Let's see. Why am I so slow? Is it just because of the glider? See, now I'm not used to the glider because I've never used one before. And now I'm just like, great. How do I stop? <laughs> how do I not glide? I feel like I have less control now. I may end up taking it off just because of that. Uh, anyways, let's see. How many times can I cast? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's like about the same. Isn't it about the same when I was using Amplify 2? Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it's slightly less. Yeah, I'd rather just have Amplify 1. I'm gonna try it out. I'm gonna use this a lot more to see how it feels. To have the gliding and all that. See, there you go. That looks cool when you're going fast like that. It's nice. I just don't like how... Uh, it's cool for getting around, but I don't like when you actually have to stop. Yeah, I probably just need to learn how to use it correctly. Because I still don't know what the hell I'm doing. 
when it's time to actually stop and land, then it's like kind of annoying because it's like the same issue like I always usually have. I have to just smash myself into the ground. I guess it's not too big of a deal because I have, you know, the horseshoe and all that. <sighs> pretty cool, pretty cool. Look at my poor, <laughs> my poor UI is getting smashed by all these enchants. So, man, so what did we do this time? I feel like we did so much crap. A lot of upgrades. All these hats, this hat, the extra level of looting. What else? Oh yeah, the onk shield. Oh my god, that was like the most important thing we did probably this patch or this uh video. That's like whoa. Farming all the netherite thanks to Nikolai, dude. Fucking Nikolai, dude. You're like Man. That idea of yours was pretty pretty good. We need to fix this. Get another buff. We'll probably get strength or something on this. That's the only other thing I could really think that would be useful. Let's put that on the list too. Reroll. Resistance bracelet for strength. I have a feeling hmm, to try and get strength and resistance on the same bracelet, we might have to do another type of bracelet like haste or something like that. Because I don't know if the bracelets that have resistance inherently on them are going to have strength in the modifier, like, list. I don't know. So, we might have to do that. Oh, I totally forgot about... I was supposed to work on this farm. <laughs> Maybe we'll do that real quick before I hop off. Let's check out the, uh, the netherite coins. I wanted to see what was up with the nether coins. Give me something good. Well... Kind of whatever. Netherite scrap. I mean, that would be good if you were desperate for netherite. You could farm a lot of uh, monsters. Blue nether brick. Hells this. Stores health. That's nice. Glowstone. That would be good. Gas tears. Worthless ass loot crates. D dude, these loot crates, I feel like they're so worthless. Like, you don't get anything out of them. All this stuff's kind of like, eh. Random dies. Random mob drops. Common loot crate. We'll just get this one just because it's glowing. Wow, they really were right, you know? Random dies. <laughs> I thought they were just joking. I should probably take the coins out of there. I forgot about all these monster ones. The monster coins for XP, was it? Stats experience. 10 monster coins. Now that's jacked up. We still don't have... We still don't have dragon slaying on here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, by the way, that would totally work then with Nikolai's method of the scrying tablet. So, you would need to initially find... Yeah, you would need to initially find a dragon nest or whatever. So you could get the charred blocks or the frozen blocks from like the ice dragon. And then you would just chuck them on the scrying thing. Ah, oh, man, I don't know if that would work though. Because if the dragon's really far away, I don't think it would work really well for like surface dragons. But I think for underground dragons, that would probably be a really good idea. We should try that out next time. Um, the problem is we need to first find an underground dragon so we can get the charred blocks. <laughs> and then we could, you know, use the charred blocks to scry for it and try and find other dragons that are underground. Ugh. Still kind of crappy. I need to use the dragon eyes too. I'm gonna try making one of the ice dragon eyes and we'll try that out. Uh, where is it? Putting this on the list. Use dragon eyes or try scrying method, scrying ritual for dragons. So next time we'll probably do that. What else are we supposed to do? Oh yeah, we need to get another wild and heart. Because we need to make the other level 3 spell book. Uh, oh yeah, we need to do the affixes next time. I couldn't do it this time. Because we're pretty much out of time. But next time we will do it.
We need to test out the gliding rune more. Uh, there was another spell that Hondo had said, which was a good CC spell. It was projectile, pierce, intangible AoE. I want to try that out too. We should try that out next time. Uh, let's put that on the list up here. Let's see what else. Well, we're supposed to finish that Illager for. I need to do that for sure. Buddy card mod. I want to hunt dragons because I want those dragon steel weapons. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. What about the combo star? What's our XP at? 58 combat. We need 65 combat to use netherite stuff. I wonder if he nerfed. Did he nerf it? No. Combat 60. That's so OP. It would be so much better to just use dragon steel. That would be the good shit. Alright guys, so I'm gonna hop off next time. Hmm. Next time we'll try out some of those spells that Hondo suggested. Probably hunt dragons. We need to do mining for diamonds and source gems. Farm wither skulls. Gamble with bracelets. Oof, I don't know if I want to do that. We need another wild and heart to make the level 3 spell book. And for sure, we need to look into taking off the affixes. It doesn't look like it's too hard. I guess you have to like make this special campfire. And then you see, we have these thingies. You burn it on this soul fire campfire. You burn like an ancient item or whatever. And it gives you the shard. And then you use the shard to make a book, which will take the affix off of that particular type of item. So you need at least one, like let's say you're you're taking off affixes from an ancient item, you would need at least one ancient item that you don't care about to shred it in this fire and then make a tome so you could take off the item that you want. But it also says the item will be destroyed uh, when you take off the affix. So that's kind of, oh man, that sucks. I'm going to lose my poor... I'm going to lose my poor uh, iron sword that I've had forever. That would be kind of sad to lose that. Kind of like, really? I don't want to lose my poor... My poor iron sword that I had forever. It was like my OG weapon that I loved. Uh, anyways. What else was I saying? I was going to say something else and I forgot. I got distracted. I don't know. I don't remember. Uh, anyways, that's it guys for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And have a good rest of the day. Bye.